Alright. Hi, I'm Annie. I'm on Middlebury College Speed Patrol. Um, today we're going to be doing an OFC practical for altered mental status. So as I approach the scene, I want to make sure the scene is safe and there's no hazards. I then want to make sure I have my PPE, which means gloves, a face mask, and eye protection. Um, so then I'm going to approach the scene and approach the patient to ask permission to carry. So hi, my name's Annie. I'm on Ski Patrol. Can I help you? Yes, please. Can you tell me your name? Kira. All right, so Kira, we're going to help you out today. We've gained permission to treat the patient and we're going to ask them what happened. So what happened? I don't remember. If the patient doesn't remember, we're going to look for a bystander who can give us some more information. So hi, did you see what happened? Yes, she fell and hit her head. All right, so we've got a potential head injury. We want to hold the spine in a neutral inline position, so I'll instruct my bystander to do that and keep the head in that position for the whole time you treat the patient. Um, at this point, we're going to assess the patient's ABCDs, starting with airway, make sure the airway is open. Then moving on to breathing, we're going to look for um, equal chest rise and fall um, and make sure it has a good rate. So circulation, we're going to assess the pulse. Is it okay if I touch your wrist? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm going to feel her radial pulse and count for 30 seconds. Make sure the strength and regularity is within normal limits. So I'll wait 30 seconds. And then this is a good time to also assess the breathing. So you can tell the patient that you're just going to check it one more time and maybe put your hand on their chest. Um, and then watch their breathing for an additional 30 seconds and make sure that the breathing rate and quality are also within normal limits. So I'll just do that. Okay, so 30 seconds is up. The uh, pulse and breathing are within normal limits. Moving on to circulation as well, we want to make sure that the skin is pink, warm, and dry. It has good color. Um, and check the body for any deformities. Make sure there's no other injuries occurring. I don't see any else. So now we want to assess the patient's level of responsiveness. Um, so can you tell me your name? Kira. Hi Kira, um, do you know where you are today? The uh, Snowball. All right, and do you know what day it is? I don't know. Um, and do you know what happened? Can you describe that one more time? I don't remember. Okay, so the patient's only responding to NO times two to person and place. Um, at this point, we're gonna continue to hold manual inline stabilization of the spine and reassess their vitals. I'm gonna make a sailor call to ski patrol to get some backup help. So, come in ski patrol, this is Annie. Yep. So I've got a 20 year old female, we're on the lane. Um, she's fallen and hit her head. We could use backup patrollers, a backboard, a head bag, and supplemental oxygen. Can you meet us down here? Ski patrol's responding. 